Welcome to another episode. All right, we got back and tries today. So working the back side, okay? So uh, back, triceps, awesome combo to do. I know most people usually do like thighs and tries, back and chest, but this is a good way to mix it up for you guys. So you have four super sets of exercises. One back exercise, one try exercise. Go through your set for three rounds and then move on to the next one, okay? Let's do this. All right, so first one you have are dumbbell press-ups. So you're gonna take your dumbbells, okay? Press it up, keep your elbows in, okay? Elbows are in, you don't wanna let them bow out. So dip back, okay? Tricep press-ups. Depending on what weight you have, make sure um, you're challenging yourself, okay? So if you have lighter dumbbells, then go more reps. I'm gonna demo today with about 10 to 12 on each, okay? Just based on the weights that I'm using, but obviously, if you have heavier weight, you might wanna go lighter, lower in your reps, okay? All right, then we have plank rear rows. So when you're doing your row on these, your palms face down. Okay, so rather than a row this way, which we'll do in the, on the next set. Okay, so here, in your plank, and you're gonna go to your armpit, okay? So dumbbell comes up to the armpit on these rows. Core tight. Tricep press ups, press ups, and then your plank rear rows. Go through that three times through, okay? Then you have your bent over row. So, bent over rows. Squeeze back between the shoulder blades on these. Belly in, don't tuck your tail. Stick your ass out, belly in, and drive it back. Squeeze in between those shoulder blades when you pull back. Okay, then you have twist kickbacks for triceps. For these, I like to go a little bit lighter, okay? So I'm gonna use my seven and a halfs. So again, you're in that position. Stick your ass out, belly in, okay? Chest up, kick back, twist up. So palms face up. Ponytails in the way today. Whoa, those are hard. Okay. Now, you should be feeling a little bit of fire. All right, so you have three rounds of that. Take a breather, take a break. Then you're gonna do rear flies and skull crushers. So rear flies for your upper back, rear delts. Um, let me see. Actually gonna stay with the sevens on this one. So palms face in. Okay, you can do this different ways in the hand position as you might have seen in my other videos, but I like this one. Whew. Oh my goodness. Okay, this angle. We're in this angle a lot for back and tries. If you have a bench or something, you can always do like a single arm bent over row, okay? You can, you can do it that way as well. Um, so you can vary it up. But since I, I'm utilizing no equipment and just dumbbells today, I'm showcasing these exercises that way, okay? So you have your rear flies, now you're gonna do your skull crushers. So you're gonna lay down flat on the ground, okay? Dumbbells come to your ears and press up. Okay, elbows, you don't want to rock. Don't rock through your elbows, okay? Elbows isolated, press straight up. Okay, woo baby! All right, the next exercise 
in this last set is actually on the floor. So you've done three supersets already. This is your fourth superset. Two exercises back to back for three rounds. You have pullover twists and crab walks, which is just body weight, okay? So pullover twists. You can use a little heavier, but if you've never done this motion, um, based on shoulder flexibility, you might want to start a little bit lighter, okay? So, gonna be flat. Arms pull overhead, and then twist. Scooch down. <laughs> All right, so pull overhead, and twist down. Pull overhead, twist. Pull over, arms come down. Keep that core tight. Don't let your back come off the floor. Okay, so you don't want to arch through here. You don't want to arch up. Okay, so belly in on these. Palms face the ceiling on the way over. And then come to neutral at the bottom. One more. Oh, baby. Good. Okay. Then set your dumbbells down and you're gonna do your crab walks. So, <laughs> all right, taking it back old school, like you're in grade school, right? They probably don't make kids do this anymore, so if you have kids at home, you should do it. <laughs> all right, so I'm gonna face you and do it. My dumbbells are in the way. Okay, coming at you. So lift your hips up, push through the heels. This is actually good for your core, good for your hands and booty, as well as shoulders and triceps. It's a good full body move. So just kind of go up and back. A couple, one, one, forward, two, two. Okay, to 10 on those. <sighs> All right, so back and triceps. Get it, get it done. 